We Canadians have some of the most renowned nature right in our backyards, and this spring we are celebrating it like never before. Welcome to Hello Spring. Hello everyone, my name is Connell. I'm a wildlife conservationist and educator living on Vancouver Island, and I'll be your guide to all things spring. Hello Spring is a platform to share and celebrate Canada's incredible spring. And we want to see a glimpse of what spring looks like where you are. Share your photos and videos using the hashtag HelloSpringCBC. Each week we'll be recapping and highlighting some of the ones that you sent in for us. After a long, cold winter like no other, it's finally time for us to say, Hello Spring! What better way to start than with that glorious yellow-breasted chat? Thanks to Michael Bezanier from the Anaukin Centre in Penticton for sending that in to us. That is a migratory species, so that chat has come all the way from Mexico to spend spring with us here in Canada. As you can see, we've already been getting some amazing content, and some of the footage has been coming from our spring spy cams. These remote cameras have been set up by our cinematographers, and they're picking up all sorts of wildlife. Spring for Wildlife is packed full of activities from showing off, looking for love, feeding hungry mouths, looking after some very cute babies, and even a bit of spring cleaning. Our spring spy cameras have been capturing all of it. And the best thing is they're just getting started. Who knows what's going to walk past them in the next few weeks. During lockdown, many of you parents might be homeschooling and have your hands full. So I'm sure you'll be able to relate to our next family. This is the red fox family in Quebec. Red foxes are found right across the country and are a species that you can see in our most rural areas and even in our largest cities, like the centre of Toronto. A lot of our videos this week have been coming from our team of wildlife filmmakers who have been out in their local areas capturing spring, including this fantastic footage of Anna's hummingbird. You can see the adult feeding the young, and they do feed them nectar, which is what the adult is mostly feeding on, but they'll also feed them insects, so things like fruit flies and spiders as well. Anna's hummingbirds spend all year on the coast of British Columbia, so you can see them throughout the seasons, but spring is the best time really to uh, see them displaying and also to see them out with their young. Another amazing video that we got sent in was from Cindy Proctor, have a look at how many hummingbirds Cindy got at her feeder in Lumbee, BC. This unbelievable footage shows two species of hummingbirds. You can see the calliope hummingbirds, which have that stripy neck, and the rufous, which are the more orangey colours. Hummingbirds are a really important part of the ecosystem. They're vital pollinators for many plants, and a lot of native species right across the country rely specifically on hummingbirds in order to survive. The last species we'll be covering is our Canada geese. We've been watching this nest all week, just waiting for those eggs to hatch. They're nesting in Stonewall, Manitoba, and after seeing just eggs for such a long time, we finally got to see something amazing happen. Can you see that tiny little chick peeking out from under their mum? And we didn't have to wait too long before it was joined by more, and we were so excited to finally see them all hatch safely. Now remember, we want to know who's showing off where you are. What local wildlife do you see in your area? Who's visiting your feeders? Let us know, share those photos and videos using that hashtag HelloSpringCBC. And here are some of the ones that we received this week. What a start we've had, and it's only going to be getting busier here on Hello Spring. We can't wait to see what things you are going to send in to us, what our spy cameras are going to pick up, and what our wildlife filmmakers have gone out and captured this week as well. Make sure that you tune in next time, stay safe, and I'll see you on the next video. Bye!